All right, welcome back to OD5, your family-friendly YouTube fishing channel. Today I'm in back in the kitchen, and um, I'm actually going to be showing you how to clean fish. This time I'm not using an electric knife. I'm actually just going to be using a fork, and um, I want you to see that in a knife, you know, just to actually get them cleaned up. All right, so as you can see here, I just have my fish down in the actual sink, and, uh, you know, you can see I have a little bit of water on them. And uh, basically, I think scaling them in the water like this keeps the scales from popping all over the place and um, wifey always appreciates that you know because um, I'm pretty much the um, the fish um, captain around here so I do all the fish cleaning the fish cooking the the disposal of the guts and all of that so you can see here I have a, a typical uh, fork alright so we got our fish moved over to the other side of the sink so I'm just gonna run a little bit more water in here for just to you know have my fish submerged while I'm cleaning here so here's our first fish that we caught just this morning. So you can see the carbon footprint is very small. You know, they're going straight from the water to my sink. So you can see I'm kind of holding them firmly around the head here. This fish is already dead, so no, no harm being done to the fish at this point. All right, so I got my water there, and I'm just going to run the fork towards the head, just like that. All right, turn it to the bottom. Turn it to the bottom like that. And you're able to get the scales off of the belly area. Come on up just under the head. Flip the fish over. Just at an angle, still working that belly area. We can cut our water off now. We have enough. And we're just, we're just doing that. And then we come up on the head like that. All right, so that fish just like that it's perfectly scaled all right so we're going to set that one aside and repeat so again we just we got them in the water here again keeps the scales from popping all over the place you're holding them firm up around the head and you're just using that typical household fork and you're just getting the scales off for every area of the fish coming up here like this again on the belly up under just under the head down by the tail just like that and then coming on up across the top. You saw in my other video cleaning fish with an electric knife. You know, if you have a larger amount of fish, you know, that might be a way to go. But I'm actually preparing these fish for the rotisserie. You know, so with these, after they're clean, all I'm going to be doing with these is actually cutting the head off of them. And gutting them and letting them soak for a few minutes. You know, again, these are croaker, you know, so they're very fair tasting you know one of my wife's favorites you know and again because they're not a huge fish I'm not going to be filleting these alright so that's number three cleaned up number four same process you can see it doesn't take much effort much time you're just holding the fish firmly and you're working through getting the belly there down by the tail Flip them over, still keeping them firm up around the head. And again, the reason why I'm here scaling in water, it keeps the scales from popping all over the kitchen. All right, and you know, if you've ever cleaned fish in your kitchen, you know, without, you know, doing this little water tip here that I like, you can be getting scales up around Christmas time. Of course, you know, right now it's just May, but uh, those scales have a way of getting all over the place. Alright, so I, I have found this to be a nice little tip, scaling them in water with a plain old fork. And, and, and yeah, you could have, you know, there are people that will tell you to use a fish scaler and all that stuff, and, and, and that's fine. You know, I'm not against them, but, um, you know, fork works good too. So now that I got them all scaled up here, just finishing up this last one, I can show you how easy it is to go about finishing the job. OD5 out. Be kind to the fish. All right, and all I'm doing here with these, you know, again, just using the sink, you know, to keep the level of mess down, I'm just cutting the heads off here, just like this.